Hey guys, it's Michaela, and today I'm going to walk you through fix for WhatsApp call and problem with microphone. Basically, if you're getting this message saying your calls end because there's a problem with your microphone, please restart the phone. I'm going to walk you through a couple of ways to check and make sure you know it's going to work. So basically, you can do what it says first. If you've made these calls before on your WhatsApp and it's just not working today, try to restart your phone because more than likely that's going to help and going to reset the app itself. So go ahead and try that. But if you turn back on your phone and it's still not working, the next thing we want to do is to go out of WhatsApp and then go into our settings. Once you get to settings, it's going to look like this. What you want to do is scroll down until you find WhatsApp. Mine's at the very bottom. And then you want to make sure that microphone is on. So you just toggle that on and it'll make sure that microphone is on. That could be the biggest issue and the reason why it wasn't working. Now once that's on, you can go back and check and see if that worked. Now if it's still not working, we want to go out of there, go to our app store, type in WhatsApp, and make sure that it's updated. This is a big thing. A lot of these apps fix glitches within their updates, so you want to make sure you're fully updated. So mine says open, which means mine is fully updated, but if yours says update, go ahead and update it and then try it again. And the last thing you want to try is to reset the app, clear the cache. So to do that, go to settings, we're out of there. So we're in settings, then we're going to go to general, iPhone storage. Once this loads, we're going to find WhatsApp. Sure, we're going to go down. Here it is, and then we're going to offload the app. Offloading the app doesn't do anything to the app itself except for clear out any of the clutter. Then you're going to reinstall app. It might take a few minutes to do it. It's just like if you deleted the app and then re-downloaded it from the app store. Super simple. It keeps all your information, but you do have to re-sign in, but it will take out any of those settings that you had previously and reset it to its original format. If you guys have any questions on that, let us know in the comments below. If not, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe.